No way. We are not as structured as many other European countries. We're more like Singapore. We only have 5 million people. So we don't have this really structured sports system. First of all, you have the clubs where the athletes kind of start when they're young. And for most of the athletes, they are in the same club until they are end their careers. When they get uh, older, the most talented might start on sports school. And the good thing about the private sports schools are that you have the opportunity to both get it like in high school education and also kind of uh, develop yourself as a talent. For all of this to happen, parents are a major stakeholder in Norway because they usually pay for the school, they pay to the club. It's not like here in Singapore when, when you're talent enough you get scholarships and and sport is free. You, ha you really have to pay for it in Norway. So it's, it's kind of very complex and the development system depends on the sport and also where in the country you live.